Well, it's been a while, but we got some comic book mystery pack goodness for you today. Three awesome packs. A deal that was too good to pass up. Hopefully it was a good one. I don't know. A little nervous, but also excited. I guess that's the whole nerves excitement thing. Can't wait to crack into this. Stick around, check it out, see what we got. Be right back after this. What's rocking, everybody? Happy Wednesday, happy day, happy everything that's going on. Happy holidays, fa la la la. Hope you had a great holiday, whatever you celebrate. Hope it was a good time, you and your family, whoever you celebrated with, that you enjoyed every minute of it. Hope it was exciting, healthy, and filled with everything that you love. Speaking of filled with everything we love, one thing we love here is comic books, and that's what we're opening up today. We got some mystery packs. Yeah, mystery packs. I put, I told myself again and again with the Funko Pop mystery boxes, I wouldn't do that with comic books. But this was a deal I couldn't pass up. It's, it was almost like one of those ones. Maybe it's too good to be true. But we'll see. Hopefully it works out well for us. But if it's your first time here, if you like comic books, if you like Funko Pops, mystery boxes, unboxings, we do it all. That's what we're here for. Click on that subscribe button down below. Much appreciate you. That's what the subscribe's there for. We, we appreciate you. We appreciate everything. What, by saying we, I usually do these with my son. All Funko Pop videos, I do with him. Comic books, I fly solo. He's not into them as much as I am. But if you like what you see today, give us a nice solid thumbs up right up top. But it's actually down below. That's where you go. Hit that button. Give us a like. Much appreciated. Much obliged to you. So, to discuss about this box here today. I got nothing else to open but this box because there are three mystery packs. This was a group I follow on Facebook called Brogan's Heroes. Um, they were mystery packs. He was doing them right before the holidays. $40 a pack, guaranteed value and return $140. And if you did three packs... He would do three packs for $100. So just over $33 a piece. Can't really beat that for the guaranteed value that they were saying. My first time ever trying from them. I know Brogan's here has got a great reputation. His packs are ridiculous from what I've seen in the past. So I couldn't wait to try it out for myself and see. Uh, this was just the end of the year inventory dump so he could clear out fresh for 2022 getting rid of a lot of stuff that he had probably piled up. I'm sure what I'm expecting in this is probably like a lot of variant covers, stuff like that. Listen, $140 guaranteed value from a $33 box. I'll take it. Not bad. But like I said, Brogan's Heroes on Facebook. That's where I found them. If you're interested, if we get anything good, go check them out. All cool stuff. Now, with these boxes, you were also able to pick... You could pick Marvel, DC, Indie, or Boobies. Yes, I said it. Boobies. But, you know, I'm a huge Marvel fan, so that's what we went with. All Marvel, all three packs. I don't know. It was one box. I think they sent all three packs in the one box. He said he was going to be slipping some slabs and stuff in these as well. This weighs a ton. Let's see what we got here. Packaged awesome. Let's see what we got. I mean, like I said, I'm very anxious to crack into these. I'm not going to be doing as many comic book mystery boxes because with comic books, I'd much rather just buy what I like and go from there. With the annoying sound of the tape. Apologize for that. There's a lot of tape. These are really packaged very, very well. Broken Heroes. Definitely impressed with the packaging. Let's see what we got here. Lots of bubble wrap. Lots of packaging. Yep, three packs. All individually wrapped. Give me a second while I unwrap this. Okay. Very cool. As you can see, Cyber Monday Mystery Packs, three Marvel. More packaging to go. 
I'm just gonna rip into this now. Enough wasting time with this. Let's see how we did, see what we got. These are hefty packs, man. Hefty, hefty packs. I wish you I could you could tell as far as the weight of these things. So as you can see, got three packs here. We're gonna go one by one. See what we got. Hopefully we got something good. It's all marble, so I know it's gonna be good. Let's see what we got. Face down. One by one. Let's see what we got. Starting off right off the bat, I don't think I got this. Actually, I do think I got this one. Venom number one. Variant edition. Very cool. As you know, this just came out not too long ago. Awesome cover on that. Very cool. Wow. That's awesome. This is, I believe, Amazing Spider-Man. Pop this out of here and see. I'm trying to remember what issue this was. Now this was Venom actually, number two. Variant edition, Comic Kingdom of Canada. Comic Kingdom variant. Very cool. For some reason I thought this was Agents or Amazing Spider-Man. But nope, Venom number two. Gonna be a lot of venom in these, huh? But that's a sick cover. Comic Kingdom Canada variant. Another venom book? I don't know. We'll see. Yes, it is. This is the. That was the virgin variant, regular variant. Lots of venom. Another venom book? We'll see. Nope, this is Spider Woman number one. This, I have the Peach Momoko variant. No, not the Peach. I have the Arc Arm variant. Don't have this one. Very sick cover with Morbius. Very cool. Very happy so far. Lasher. This one I do have. Lasher. This was from the miniseries where they did, um, what was it? Carnage. Scream, the Marvel one shots. This one was for last year. Let's see, do we get Scream or anything? This is Gwen vs. Carnage. Very cool cover on that one. Back in the King of Black days. All within the past year. Very cool variant on that one. Whole Venom theme going on, except for Spider Woman. Non stop Spider Man. I really like that one. Very cool. Happy with that as well. A lot of spidey my spidey senses were tingling on that one a lot of spider stuff going on let's see what we got in this pack here more spidey stuff we gotta get some x-men stuff we gotta get some doctor strange or we gotta stick with the spider-man don't know i want to make sure everything's face down let's see what we got Very cool. Alien number one. This was the horn variant. Very cool. I had the A cover. Most of these were like with the alien and stuff. I didn't go too crazy with the variants. Uh, I just got the A cover on the alien when it came out. That was it. But this is very cool as well. And it's not Spidey. Let's see what we got next. Moon Knight, very cool. Been collecting this whole series so far. Started off really good. Uh, it's losing me a little bit, but we'll see. Hopefully it picks back up a little bit. This is the Kirkham variant. Moon Knight number two. What else we got? War of the Bounty Hunters, Star Wars. Star Wars comics, I've never really collected recently i used to collect them all the time when i was a kid but very cool i i got all the early like dark horse issues stuff like that the new ones i really haven't gotten into too much oh the virgin variant as well very cool awesome cover book of boba fett coming out this week 
can't wait. I am a Star Wars fan. I just, as far as the books, never really got into. Book of Boba Fett, can't wait for that this week. What we got? Spider-Man, Spider's Shadow. Hmm. This series I never collected. Very cool. That's definitely going to end up being a read for me because I never bought it. Very cool. Awesome. Last but not least, Virgin Variant as well. Very cool. Definitely got to check out this series. I, this one, I this is one series I'd never read. So I'm going to have to check that. It looks like I got some reading material too. Which if I become addicted to it, then I'm going to actually have to get the whole series in. I haven't heard too much about that though. If you, if you read Spider Shadow, let me know. Let me know what you thought about it. Because I, I love my Spider-Man books, but for some reason I never really got into that one. Let's see what we got. Last pack. I want to make sure it's face down. There we go. I don't know how we're doing as far as value go. We got some virgin variants, some cool stuff. I'm sure we hit value on these. Listen, for $100, I'm sure we definitely broke $100 of value here. Let's see what we got. Captain Marvel, number 34. Very cool. I'll tell you what, too, as far as all these books are in great condition. Very clean. Awesome. Brogan's Heroes, awesome job on these. Okay, and you mixed them all up. I'm not getting, like, a lot of repeats of stuff. That's why I was worried about getting three packs that I was going to get duplicates and... Kudos to you. Very good job on that. But we said Identity Silk. That's a very cool cover with Silk and Psylocke. That's awesome. Don't have I don't have a lot of these books, believe it or not. So that's very cool too. I never really I don't chase variant covers too often. Uh, I go for the A cover, and that's usually about it. Uh, unless it's something really cool or if I'm in the store and I'll come across a 1 in 25, something like that, I'll pick it up. But other than that, don't really chase them too much. Boom. And the Virgin variant too. Awesome. Very cool. Silk. She'll be making her appearance probably soon in the MCU. Stick around for that one. Can't wait for that. What we got here? What is it? That's a Miles Morales virgin variant i'm gonna guess it's yep yeah, miles morales spider-man number 27 variant edition that's very cool awesome set you know what the brogus i got, gotta give you credit man how you just did each one with the virgin variant and the regular variant that's very cool i like i really like that you did that i'm happy man definitely happy value or not definitely happy because none of these books actually i have so two more to go this one here Miles Morales, number 25, The Clone Saga, Greg Horn. Very cool. Once again, I have the A cover of this. I don't have the Horn cover. And this is number 25 as well. This one, I don't know who did this one. But very cool nonetheless. Miles Morales, hot, hot, hot right now. Very cool. Into the Spider-Verse, or it was it next one's Edge of Spider-Verse. Trailer dropped. Can't wait. I'm very excited for that. Spider-Man 2099. Blowing up all over the place right now. You see everybody with that ASM 365 just posting it. And that Spider-Man 2099, number one, all over. It's It was mass-produced, and they had so many prints of that book. So this is going to become what the ultimate fallout was. I doubt it. But it's a very, very cool book to have in your collection. Awesome. Like I said, listen, all these books here, I mean, all of these for 100 bucks can't beat it. I, I spend that on a Wednesday in my LCS any day of the week anyway. So all of these that I don't have for 100 bucks can't beat that at all. And they're all in great shape. Brogan's Heroes, you get a thumbs up from me, my friend. Definitely cool. Definitely look forward to the packs and stuff you offer in the future. I will be buying again. Uh, but like I said, I don't do mystery 
boxes per se for comic books too often, but if it's reputable, I trust you. You got my business. Because mainly, I don't want to waste my money on mystery boxes because I'd rather buy the stuff that I want. But every once in a while, a deal comes along. Can't say no to it, so tempt me with that deal and I got you. Doesn't take much to tempt me. In the meantime, let's see. I got a lot of cool stuff coming back from CGC, so you're going to have to make sure you ring that bell for notifications. You're going to have to hit that subscribe button because... There is some cool stuff coming back, and I can't wait. Uh, what else? Mystery boxes, Funko Pop mystery boxes with the little guys. We will we will be doing them. Uh, we just kind of cut back a little bit. With the new year, we're going to notice some new things going on. We're trying to balance out the Funko Pop and the comic book material. So probably every other week, we'll do the Funko Pops, and the weeks in between, we'll be doing the comic books as well. Just scaling back as far as the mystery boxes and stuff we've been buying, because... If you've been watching us for a while, we have no luck. So we would rather buy stuff that we want and go out and get instead of getting a bunch of stuff that we don't want or need like we get from the mystery boxes. Uh, but it, other than that, very cool. We will be bought. Like I said, don't don't get nervous. Don't get nervous. He's not going anywhere. We are still doing them. Stick around um, because he will be back. He asked me today. He's like, we got to do a video soon. I'm like, yeah, when we got a mystery box coming in, we'll do another video. He is dying. Like, he's dying to do them. He just, he's not into the comic books as much as I am. But he will be back. He loves you guys. We love you guys. We appreciate you. We thank you. Leave us a comment down below. Which was your favorite out of everything we pulled today? It was a whole lot of modern Marvel goodness. A lot of modern stuff. Modern stuff. I like the older stuff personally better. I'm an old guy. That's what I like. That's what I grew up on. That's what I chase after. But this this stuff is cool. Definitely happy with it. In the meantime, people, keep on rocking. We love you. Happy New Year. We'll see you next year. Maybe beforehand. We'll see. Peace out. We'll see you soon.